Let's just add another joint, which is a beam to column flange on the input. And we can either have results on the left on graphics right or top and bottom. I'll work with top and bottom. It gives me a bigger picture. And I put a title in. Two minute joint. And it's going to be bolted. Forces, just go in 450, 340, 175, end of haunch 250, and yes. So let's take our column and we'll change that from 101 to 125. Take our rafter, change that from 74 up to 82 kilograms. And at the same time, I'm going to give it a 6 degrees of slope and I will use a haunched length of 2.5 meters and an overall depth of 900. So there's my basic configuration of the joint. I uh, just need to pull up this row of bolts. So I just go to bolts and the bottom and change that up to 100. Now you can either do them manually or in my case I can just go and say you design it for me, 90 centers and just automatically puts the compression stiffener in, two rows of bolts top, two bolts of bo bolts bottom, and close. Now, add a second case in, it automatically has two cases. So for my second case, I'm going to go for a negative moment of 350, and a negative shear of 300, and a negative axial of 75. And we will see that we have a tension comp problem here with our weld. So just click on the weld and bottom weld, change that to an 8mm weld and that is our joint designed.